I was down in New York City in the summer on Bleecker Street or McDougal Street, and I heard her song, the one about the clarinet player, how he played so high and free. And those lyrics were like bouncing off the walls. I was so impressed in general with the fact that she seemed to be kind of radical to the rest of the kind of mamby pamby singers. She had some grit to her, uh, particularly after she did that thing with Charles Mingus. And I wanted to tell her how much I really appreciated that. Because, you know, most of the people in that music scene don't really hang with none of those heavies. She just never seemed to have a problem with it. You know, so I've always loved her music. I've always loved her, uh, her intent. And I just think she's a fabulous artist. And, you know, a world treasure in terms of, you know, music, you know, lifestyle, everything. So, Tony, I hope there's more music and more great ideas that you have for albums or poetry or collaborations or anything. You know, there's somebody that I'm always keeping an eye out for what they're doing next. And uh, personally, i got to tell you, I love you. And uh, I'm sticking to that. Take good care. <laughs>